Previously. Would you be a lovely lass and get some embalming fluid from the heavily guarded- Absolutely. Two hours later! Have you got the embalming fluid? Yes. Can I possibly- No. So, anyhow. Huh. Well, this is nice. And that just about brings us up to date. Hello there, Tomb Raiders. This is your captain, Alonzo Ryan speaking, and welcome back to the 32nd part of our blind let's play of Tomb Raider 3. We're now moving on to the crash site from our previous level, the coastal village. Let's get into it, shall we? I've been quite looking forward to this because I've heard a lot of good things about it, but that's it. Nothing but good things. I mean, literally. No spoilers whatsoever. Just that it's good. So, yeah. Don't know what to expect- oh, hello. I don't know what to expect. Crash site? I'm assuming it's some kind of plane crash, but who knows. Um, it looks like we're still in the village. We are indeed still in the village, and there's this dude here. Who apparently um, was shouting me in the previous level uh, from this place when we were underneath it. You remember? Um, I thought the tribesmen were shouting at me, but it turned out it was actually him. Shouting, hey Sheila, and um, hey you, or something like that. And uh, yeah, I never noticed. Apparently, it's very rare that happens, but knowing me, I just managed to catch it somehow. Oh, okay. So, where exactly are we going here? I remember we came through here, and this is where we jumped from, but it's now sealed off, so I'm guessing we're going to below. Um. Hmm. Let's go with Uzis, because we're running a bit low on shotgun ammo now. Not too bad, but, you know. Tiny bit low. Uh, so, like... Yeah, we're back into the... We're still, we're still in the coastal village. Are we heading somewhere specific? Let's jump over here, because I remember we... We headed this direction in the previous level, didn't we? And, um... Ah, that's now, that's now a slope. I see. So I'm just going to assume that they've been reconstructing this village between, um... Now and the last part I recorded. Because that's the only explanation I can have. For why it's changed. Otherwise it makes no sense. And what the fuck is that coming from? I assumed that was a boulder, but... Oh. This is interesting. I think we're actually... Oh, shit! Experiencing a new earthquake, and I just realised I'm muting my laptop. Oh, I didn't do that in the last bloody part, did I? Did I? Right. So, this is interesting. To say the least. Um... Bloody hell. This is going to be tough. I mean, like, you can't actually see where it's going to be falling down from. So you just got to, it's just going to be kind of hit and miss, isn't it? I suppose we could slowly walk through it. It might fall down before us if we did that. Right, there we go. Yeah, it's kind of falling down before us if we walk slowly, which is good. Uh, where are we headed here, though? I'm guessing we're going up here. It's kind of hard to focus when the bloody camera is shaking all over the place. Oh, maybe we're not. Can't get up there. Ooh. Oh, this is making my eyes funny as well. Oh no. Oh god, I was worried I actually glitched it out already. Um, What are we doing here then? Oh, maybe we're climbing up here. I never thought of that. And no. Where can we go? Is there anywhere we can go? I mean, um, can't be stuck this early on. Swamp map. How long have I had this for? Right, okay. I... Well, that... that this is embarrassing. Ah. Uh, um, I'm 
guessing we can use that to get across the swamp. Oh, I'm assuming this is the swamp, unless it's somewhere that I need to... Okay, I'm going to go ahead and assume it is. Um, so, like, w w w it starts off in the middle. I can't believe that. I've been literally diving around that area for about 20 minutes. And I, I should really check my items more, I guess. If... If the map is right, I need to jump across there, don't I? Because it shows that it's in the middle of the swamp at the moment, so it's like... This better be stable. No, it isn't. I'm sinking into it. So where's it... Where does it start? Uh, I guess I did that wrong. I mean, there must be like a solid area somewhere. Ah, here it is. So it starts from this part right next to it, so I've got to jump over to there. I've had feedback on um, the little FAQ I did. Elsie Hawkins, yeah, I think that's right. They stated Tomb Raider level editor is mostly based on Tomb Raider 4, so it's probably a good idea that before I start doing Tomb Raider level editor that I actually play Tomb Raider 4 first, and I completely agree if that is the case. Which I'm going to go ahead and assume it is. I doubt she would tell me that if... Oh my god, this is going to be such a pain in the ass. We've just got to kind of... Figure out which blocks are stable and which aren't. Does this ripple? It does as well. Everything ripples, so how the hell are we supposed to know? Oh, this is going to be such a pain. Right, so it's over in that direction somewhere. Uh, so yeah, thank you very much for that, Elsie. And also, I completely forgot to mention, but I really uh, want to do... Oh, there we go, we found it. Uh, I really want to do the Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3 expansion packs before I move on to Tomb Raider 4 as well. So, yeah, we're going to be doing that after this, hopefully. Uh, wait, 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 where is it? Well, at least we can figure these out slowly. So it's somewhere in the distance over there, by the looks of things. This isn't going to go well, is it? It's somewhere over here. It says it's quite far away, so... I'm guessing it's that one over there. Yes, there we go. Okay, this isn't as bad as I thought it would be. Watch me miss one now. It's over here somewhere. So... Is it that one, or is it that one? Let's double check, shall we? It's... This one here, I'm thinking. I can't wait to get off this already. Uh, that that bloody earthquakes are very misleading. I'm guessing it was just collapsing the the exit from this level to back to the previous level. If you get what I'm saying, because I remember we came from that kind of di direction, so to speak. So, right, so we need to go up now. So it's over in this direction. I'm guessing it's that one there. Hopefully, it is. Yes, it is. Okay. Next one is... To the right? To the left, sorry. So I'm guessing it's that one there. Uh, I should keep an eye out, because there might be areas that we can jump onto the sides that have secrets. You never know. I uh, don't think we've encountered anything like that just yet. Oh, fucking hell, there's a moth in my room. Had a problem with moths lately. It just flew past my face between the TV and me. <sighs> but yeah, I've, I've, uh, we've had an infestation lately, which isn't good. I think it's coming from my mum's room, but occasionally I will find a few in here. I hate killing insects, I really do, because I do love insects, but uh, sometimes it's necessary when you've got bloody too many of them in your house, you know. Uh, I see a ledge over there, but it might be misleading me, if you get what I'm saying. I think it's worth a go. It might be a trap. On the other hand, it might be a secret. Oh shit, okay, we landed on it, that's good. So we can get in here. And it's a secret, fantastic. And I already know that we we have three secrets in this level because um, when I when I was looking at the map, when, sorry, when I found the map, I was actually just looking at the compass before that, so. <clears throat> and um, I believe that was two rockets. Is it? Uh, maybe not. MP5 ammo, maybe? 
just loot like it is the case. Anyway, we can get off here and we can finally get back onto land by the looks of it, but we need to remember what where we came from. It's there, wasn't it? At least I'm hoping it is. So let's jump over in that direction. And there we go. Now we can jump over to land finally. And I need to get a gun out because we have the pistols at the moment. Because I died from when I equipped the Uzis. So there we go. Right. Okay, so. Here we go. Ah, right. This is kind of looking like the beginning of the previous level at the moment. Uh, wonder where the crash site is. Like the actual crash site itself. Just wonder if we can walk around here. I'm not sure if we can or not, but it's worth a check. Just in case there's like secrets around this area or if there's any items perhaps. You never know. There might just be nothing. But still it's worth a check, isn't it? I don't really like there is anything. Okay. Well at least we can say we checked it. And is there anywhere else we can check around here? Hmm. Don't really like it. So let's head down there, shall we? Don't think there's anything we can do here. Let's just check behind here first. Because it looks like once we've gone down there we can't come back. So it's always good to check everywhere first, isn't it? I've got such an itch on my nose at the moment. It's annoying the hell out of me. Oh, I've got to say a huge thank you to anyone who's helped me with um, with trying to obviously fix my videos. Uh, anyone who's helped encourage YouTube or Google or whatever to sort the problem out and stuff like that. Just a huge thank you to everyone. You know, oh fucking hell. Whoa! No way! No fucking way! Did you see how many bullets that took? This is one of my most powerful guns and it took like 150 I think. Wow, you certainly stepped up your game. In Tomb Raider 1 you went down so bloody easily. And now look at you. What the fuck, have you like bloody equipped armor or something? Ah, <sighs> right, um, well, looks like these guys are going to eat through my ammo, aren't they? What gun should I use, do you reckon? Bloody rocket launcher, I think. Uh, I think I'll go for the MP4, uh, MP5 even for now, but, um, yeah, it's, it's if I actually see them come running first, really, isn't it? Because if I don't, I'm going to be in deep shit, because uh, this is no short-range weapon. Uh, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. I should probably. I, I'm thinking this level's gonna literally destroy my ammo. This is gonna be such pain. You bastards! You knew this was gonna happen, and this is why you're. This is your favorite level, or why you were looking forward to me playing it. I fucking hate these bloody dinosaurs. Or I didn't Tomb Raider one anyway. They don't look much friendlier here. I nearly actually let this guy. That I took damage from that. Must have been just out of bloody Laura's limits for jumping, I guess. So it doesn't look like there's actually anything here in this area. This mist is a bit bizarre. I mean, I like the effect it was going for, but it just doesn't work, I'm afraid, core design. Uh, I mean, like, mist doesn't work like that. It kind of covers an area, it doesn't kind of just exist as a sheet. Yeah, oh well. Right, so let's go this way. And I think that's... Is it? Is it water or is it... It's water. I thought it might have been quicksand, but it doesn't look like it is. What was that sound? I'm sorry, but that is absolutely terrifying. It's the sound that Laura's making as she's turning around. Listen. There. It's the underwater sound, and I swear to god it was something growling at me. Oh man. That shoot me up for a moment. It really did. Right. So it looks like we're making more um 
well, making damn sure that the dinosaurs are actually extinct for um, for this level. Which is good, isn't it? Uh, I'm switching weapons. This is tight. Let's just stick to the Uzis for now. I really can't use the... Um, the MP5 is going to be a weapon that I'm going to not be able to use as much, I'm afraid. Because I'm just not very good at it, I'm afraid. Uh, right, okay, it looks like we're climbing up here. Just what wonders await me up there. Better get my rolling skills going on here. Because uh, I'm going to need it with these dinosaurs, aren't I? <sighs> what, what are these? Are they just pterodactyls or pterodactyl? I don't bloody know dinosaurs. I'm going to shut up before I say something embarrassing. Geography, dinosaurs, history, anything like that. I'm bloody hopeless with it. I only specialise in certain areas of everything. Uh, when it comes to geography, that special area is England! That's it. Actually, fuck that. I don't know most areas of England. Just where a good place to get a drink is, I guess. Uh, let's very cautiously drop down here. Mm, mm, eh. Come on, make yourself apparent. I know you're here somewhere. Fucking dinosaurs. Right, this is more open area again. I'm sorry I'm going to keep switching weapons a lot, but I really want to get the best out of the MP5. <sighs> right. Okay, this is going to be a very jumpy level for me. Oh, shit, here we go. Yep, just keep firing more, don't stop. Oh, that took it down a lot quicker. Maybe it's just the Uzis have a certain range of effect, if you get what I'm saying. Uh, that could well be the case. What the hell? Oh, right. Okay, that's the, that's the crash site. I'm wondering if there's any survivors, because obviously the, um... Oh, I never thought the Austra- the, right, the Australian guy, yeah. The- right, yeah, of course, someone- someone in the pre- in the comments of the previous part said, um... that the cannibals might not have been what was actually eating on him. I never thought it could have been one of these. But obviously I didn't know, aside from the loading screen hint, that there would be any dinosaurs. So, yeah. I guess it was a dinosaur after all that was chewing on him and not one of the cannibals. Uh, so that's where his leg went. And that's kind of why he should be safe up a treehouse, actually, because the dinosaurs can't get up there, but that said, the tribesmen could. Uh, right, okay, so what are we doing here? Looks like we can climb up here. Uh, actually, no, we can't. It's just... Uh, I can see a area we can jump and grab there and shimmy across by the looks of it. Uh, no, we can't get down there. But it doesn't look like we can get up there at the moment. I'm thinking we probably come from the other side, actually, to get to there. So, uh, uh, it looks like we can also climb up here. Though, will we benefit from that at all? I do not know. No, it looks like Laura refuses to click get up there, actually. So, let's fuck it. Uh, huh. Actually, we can climb up there, but I'm thinking we need to climb onto the top of the uh, airplane first. Airplane, aeroplane... I'm never sure what it is. What's the difference between an aeroplane and an airplane? Or is it just some weird mispronunciation I've been making for years and years and years? I'm going to change my weapons again, back to the Uzis. Hope you don't mind me changing so much. Just being tactical. I had a really funny comment, um... From... Wait a minute, what, what's this? What, what is this? Secret... I, I've wrote something, I cannot read what the hell it says. Secret, secret... Oh, bloody hell, of course! Oh, bloody... Uh, right, normally, of course, at the beginning of levels, I do, um... I loot where, where I miss secrets. And I've wrote down bloody secret Will Davis here, but I've completely... But, well, I've wrote it in a really weird way, in a way that I couldn't actually read it myself. So, uh, yeah, I'm sorry about that, but we'll have to check what the previous level secret was that I missed. 
in the... Oh, shit. Is that what I think it is? It is, yeah. I don't know where I'm aiming at. That's the problem. Come after me. Come after me. Oh. No, it's taken down one of the guys. I need to save these guys, really, don't I? But I'm afraid I might end up shooting them instead. Come on. Help me here. There we go. Right. Well, at least I managed to save one of them. One of them's gone down, though. Has he dropped anything by any chance? Oh, he has as well. They do drop things when they die. Ah, uh, perhaps it's not a bad thing, then, when they do go down. <laughs> and they appear to have bloody, uh, the weapon that I'm missing. Or, or do they? I don't know. What what have they dropped? Oh, MP5. Okay, that's what it looks like. It's got yellow on it, MP5. Uh, so, me confusing the rockets with the MP5. There we go. I know the difference now, at least. Oh, that is dark. Alright. So, yeah, like I was saying... Uh, I'm gonna have to do the secret from the previous level in the next level. Really sorry about that. I know I missed one of them, but I have no idea where it is, so I can't really say it now. Ugh. Normally I write it at the top, but I didn't bother this time for some reason. Right. Oh, you bastard. How many times has the game done this to me? It's just like one block that we can't see for some reason. Alright. Uh... Yeah, these these guys could well save me. So it looks like it looks like the um, the Uzi isn't as powerful as I thought it was. It looks like the MP5 is actually a lot better than the Uzi. Uh, stop that! Don't do that stupid camera angle. Thank you. So where can we go from here? I can see through there. Doesn't necessarily mean we can do anything with it though. Hmm. That looks very sloped. However, we can go back down, I guess. I can see through there. You're hiding something from me, game. I know it, and... Um... Or is it just some place that's completely inaccessible? It's a possibility. It's entirely a possibility, you never know. Yeah, let's, uh... We need to go back to the to the airplane at some point, and also I feel if I fall down here, we're going to be stuck in there, so I'm saying let's go back to the airplane now, actually, as opposed to later. So we just need to do a short jump over this way, and we're back onto here. Uh, let, let's continue to check around these areas anyway. Oh, fright me for a moment. Yeah, he's going to be patrolling around this area by the looks of it for a while. So what do we have in this cave? Kind of worried. Can we go back at any point? Oh, this is an entirely new area by the looks of it. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, can we... Yeah, we can jump up here. But, oh, jeez. This is going to be a pain in the ass. I'm just going to let him deal with that, and then we'll finish him off with our pistols. Which hopefully will be a possibility. Okay. He seems to have done okay. Oh, he had his friend help him. Cool. Right, okay, so that's two, three areas even now that we have. That we can access anyway. Um, let's take a wander across. Oh, you bastard! I knew something like that would happen. Right, it looks like we... Okay, we can't get out there. We've got piranhas chasing after us as well. This is a bastard. What a dick. Oh god, they are going through our health quick. <sighs> Real quick. We can't stop. We cannot stop. Ooh, fucking hell. <sighs> we need to just find a place that we can get out of the water as quickly as possible. My god! A health is going down so quick. I'm literally eating through my medipacks here. Uh, I think we can get out here. Yes! Oh. Fucking hell, that was lucky. You dicks. Right. It's a shame we can't shoot these. I mean, they seem to be the only unkillable thing that we've come across so far. And what a dick they are. Right, so, uh... Bridge trap. Got it. So... It looks like the third area kind of is a bit 
iffy in a sense, in the like, in the sense that we can't actually do much with it. Oh, wait a minute, no, I think we can actually. Uh, looks like we can climb up here. I hear something moving around. Holy fuck! Well, that was a bit scary. What what was that? Is it above us, or...? Oh, it's up there. What the fuck are you doing up a tree? Dinosaurs don't belong in fucking trees. Muppet. That's that guy. Uh... Can we jump across to there? I can't really see. To be honest. Um... It looks like there's a small... Yeah, there we go. Small ledge here. I was hoping we could perhaps shoot him from here. It does appear to be the case. Because otherwise, if we climb up there, what are we going to do? Wait a minute, what? Oh, right, she's picking up the flare. Of course, I did drop one just a moment ago. Uh, can we climb up here? That would be easier. But. I love the way the guys below us are actually panicking at the moment. They're, wa they're kind of wandering around in a circle and stuff. Careful I don't shoot those accidentally. It's a possibility. Right, um I'm I'm just I'm just wondering, do you reckon we can jump across yeah, it does look like we can actually now. Yeah, we can definitely jump across there. There's two parts of the bridge that it's possible to go across. Let's uh let's try gain up this tree first. I mean we've kinda of weakened the uh dinosaur that's at the top of it. Uh, this is actually the earliest in the in a in a day that I've recorded Tomb Raider in a long time. I think the first part I recorded, uh... The, f the first level even, the jungle, I recorded... Uh, it was rather early. But not as early as this, anyway. Right... I've got to be cautious here. I really have. I don't really like I can actually get up there, to be honest. I don't feel I can, anyway. Ah. I see exactly what I've got to do there. I've got to be careful, though. Um, I'm going to use a large medikit. I can see myself eating for a lot of supplies in this level. So this seems to be absolutely jam-packed full of danger. So let's try that again. We've got to do a backflip and then we've got to kind of jump off the ledge. But we've got to be careful we don't actually take any damage and kill ourselves. It's a possibility, so... So here we go, we need to jump and then jump again, essentially. Like that. Oh shit. Don't know how I'm gonna deal with this guy, because it is a really fucking thin ledge, isn't it? Might be a good idea if I get my, um... No, oh, fuck it. Oh! Oh, what the hell. Oh my god, I've just realised I haven't actually done any saving yet, have I? Oh no! Oh, I'm gonna have to do the bloody swamp again, aren't I? That's no problem. It's not that bad. Oh, well, let's give it another go anyway. 